Mm. Wagwan. That means, how are you in Jamaican? Trying to learn another language. Uh, I've done a bit of a, a bit of a pencil sketch. Um, no, whopping a bit of a sky in this bit here. <coughs> I'm gonna get this done, then take my dogs a walk. <laughs> Got two dogs, snoppy head, and numpty dumpty. Take a move a walk. <laughs> this is just a sort of pale blue sky, not much to it. <laughs> Talking of pets, got me two dogs, soppy and numpty dumpty, right? Well, doofus, he's got a bit jealous, hasn't he? Um, just gonna grab that bit back, look. See how I've gone over that bit of drawer in there? I'll grab that bit back, because I want that quite bright. So I'll just take the paint back out, let me think like that. <laughs> Yeah, um, because I've got a pet, Doofus has got to have a pet, right? So, he's going out in the garden looking for a pet. So, I thought, well, I can find a pet there. Well, he has. He's only found himself a pet worm. <laughs> a pet worm. I've never heard out so daft in my life. I've been taking dogs at walk, right? Let me just try this. So Doofus, you're not even going to believe this, Doofus has been taking his pet worm by found in garden for a walk. So he's been keeping it in one of them tubaway containers and then he takes it for, he says, a walk. Uh, worms sort of wiggle now and they don't, I don't think they walk. I just saw a wiggle. So, but according to Doofus, he's taking it for a walk. Well, I always thought he had to have legs to go for a walk. But not according to Doofus. Doofus is me. Oh, no, he's not my half brother, he's my step brother. So, we're related. through that bit there. Don't have to worry about that. Um, down to about there. And then I need some to darken this colour. Yeah, Doofus is my step brother. But I had thought at least he's happy. He's got his pet worm. It's keeping him happy. So, <laughs> that's in garden. And he lets this worm loose on grass. And uh, well, in Doofus's head, he's, uh, he's taking his pet worm for a walk. Uh, that's how he sees it. He's, he's also got, I'm not even counting this. I don't even count this in, but he's got a pet fly as well. It's not even, it's not even a fly. It's, it's just, it's not the same one, Doofus. It's just every time he sees a fly, 
it was going, oh, it's Gavin. It's not Gavin, it's just a random fly. It's not the same one, doofus. I'm trying to get out through to him. Oh, you really are banging your head against a brick wall trying to talk to doofus. But it's not, so I'm not counting his fly because it's not the same one. It's just a random fly. But yeah, you can't explain that to Doofus. So I'll just let him get on with it. Texas worm for a walk. <laughs> you couldn't make it up. <laughs> so I think Garden walking a worm. I thought I'll take his dogs out for a walk, Doofus. Ow, take me worms. Whatever, Doofus. You're a lunatic. Right. I think that'll do. I don't think I need too much detail in there for that. Right. <coughs> um, it's a big tree here. It cuts through. It, it's going to hide off this. Um, right. I'm going to pop that in next, I think. <coughs> but anyway, when I've done here, I'll take uh, Numpty Dumpty and Soppy Head for a walk. Hopefully, they'll behave the scent and not cause me any trouble. Right, That's, this sort of comes right out of my page here and sort of comes in about here. It was right up here. Some yellowing. Do need some bright colours in this bit. There we go. That's that right now. I need to go really dark. So I've mixed that green with some. I think I'm just going to mix it with paint grey, see what happens, see what that looks like. So that's green and paint grey. That looks pretty good, I think. And then I'm going to come down on this side. These leaf branches are sort of turning up a little bit. I'll see now there's more dark than light. So <coughs> I have to make that darker. Plenty of paint on the brush. This time, uh, right, so we sort of come in like that. There we are. So, lights coming in on that side. Spiky brush there. Brush. Bush. Not brush. Spiky bush there. So I'm using the little spiky brush with my battered up bristles. I'm just gonna go in there like that. And get that spiky bit. There, like that. And then I'll just get it back into shape. That's it, I think that looks alright, doesn't it? Hopefully. It's even more black in there. It's really, really dark. <laughs> Some more in. Especially over this side. The darker I get it, the closer it's gonna feel to me. Right, that'll do. Right. Now then. So look. In the dark green there. Mm -hmm. <coughs> Same again, there's a light bush here. So I'm going to have to get my dark green. Come right into this 
this bush here. So it comes right down here, down here, down here, around that one, down there, into there like that, up here. Too dark, really. Put some yellow in. Some more yellow in. Uh, mm. Mm, can it that? I might get my spiky edges from that. I need a spiky edge on this. Uh, See how that looks like pine trees. Hopefully. That's my pine trees in there. That's it. And then to get some of it they're quite close so I want to get some of these ones in there, aren't they? some bigger ones yeah because they're quite close up so you can see these bigger ones in there like that So that's what it looks like in picture. Some bigger ones there than here. Some of the that one's a bit closer and all the rest. So I'm just going off my photograph. <laughs> So, yeah, oh, then again, now let's use this dark up while it's on my brush. So I'll get in here. Oh no, it's not that dark. Right. Mm -hmm. So this is actually a pine tree, isn't it? So, um, right. let me squeeze my brush out. I'm going to wash my brush. There's a big... Pine tree. Just in here. This is it. Yeah. My screen's gone do lally again. Yeah, that's better. I've got my picture on the screen. Ding, 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 ding. I think this picture is in Scotland. Scotland, it's got the um, Highest rates for heart attacks anywhere. Doofus reckons that that probably means that you can get some nice grub up there. Or I don't know. I've heard about this Scottish grub. All right. You know I like our main grub in this country would be like um, probably Yorkshire pudding in um, on like a dinner like a Sunday dinner with Yorkshire pudding 
potatoes, a bit of beef or something. That would be like our sort of thing, innit? That's what we'd sort of eat. Do you know what then is up in Scotland? Battered Mars bars. Well, I'm not having a go, whatever, that if that's their culture, but I can't think of no more disgusting a battered Mars bar. I prefer just a battered sausage. Battered sausages, lovely. Battered Mars bars, no, I won't want one. I won't thank you for one. I would not want a battered Mars bar. I'm going pretty dark here, but remember, it's going to dry a lot lighter. And the darker I get it, the more better that these lights are going to stand out in the next colour. Right, so that's that. Uh, there's a bush in here. I might need to wait for that to dry to get that one. Right, what we got now? That tree. This bush here is dark. So, no. Put my light on him first. Right, so I'm going to rinse that bush. Brush out to paint this bush. So, yeah, if you want a battered Mars bar, get this into Scotland. They love them. Nice bush there. There. Um, let's, put, let's get a tiny bit of darker colours into them. Sometimes take my little detailing brushes. Cheers, Molly. Molly bought me them. Molly Mayhem. Um, and Ben. Molly and Ben. Um, my little detailing brushes. And I just use these little detailing brushes just to get in, look. And it just takes me. So it gives me that edge. See, like I need a little edge on this bush to separate that one from that one. So these bushes, brushes, not bushes, will do that. There we are. Perfect. Right now. I need a dark one now. What colours on here? And the dark bush here. I think where it is. It's in shadow off this tree. Let's give me the dark bush all the way across there. That's some grasses and that there. There we are. A go darker than that. have a look. I think I'm going back to this brush, back to me eye brush. And just what we got here, oh, it's quite bright. Squeeze mm. that Wash my brush. Get some brighter colour. It's pretty bright in here. Right, so that sort of comes down there, that down there, like that, that down there, I think, dee 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 dee, this, yeah, that comes down there, dee 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 dee, 
there's some shadows and I'm going to put them in in a minute so that's that um, yeah this one's really bright oh, where's that spiky brush squeeze that spiky brush out clean it and stuff there and there that's it oh, I'll leave that at that for now yeah, maybe they even put a bit in there warm that bit up a little bit there yeah right mm. let's come on this side really bright stuff in here creamy colour so if I add a bit of red to that yellow that'll give me a more creamy colour so it was more creamy as it comes down here this is all creamy colour and all that's grasses right so that's that um, mm. Alright, let me get a mix of this creamy colour now because them rocks are a creamy colour. That looks alright. Alright, uh, 22 minutes. I don't want to take up all day of your time. What's that? Right, let's get a card, credit card, and just get some highlights on these rocks like that. There we are. Get a bit of this scraper here and all. It's like some ridgy things like that and all. So, I don't know what that is, it's anything you can use to scrape. I've got plectrum. Um, a bit of cut up bank card yeah, cut it up so I won't spend no money um, some oh it looks gaudy use it uh, right same again in here this is a little of rocks in here now uh, on this one there's some really dark bits in there so I'll just whack a few of them bits in I think before I scrape it I use me little bit credit cardy bit for this one. I'll try and get it a bit random and it quite often looks better. So they're smaller bits there. Just looking at it. There's some of this darker stuff in here, so I'll just pop a few bits in. There. So that's rocks. Maybe pull some of that out, make it look more rocky. You can do what you want. World is your lobster. <coughs> oh, I'll tell you what I could do. I could come in here and just get some little blade of grassy type things in there. Look. Get this. Some little blades of grass in. See that? Put that down here now if I wanted. Just in there and in there like that. Little tiny blades of grass. Look. Just 
just scratching them in. Can't think of an easier way to bleed grass. Right, um, I think. Put a creamy colour in here and all that. What colour's on this brush? It's hard to. Just a dirty colours on this brush, so that'll do for me for a bath. Like that. Same again. Where's my big detailing brush? I've got a bigger one here for detailing. This one. Detailing brush. Perfect job. Watch this. Neaty D. I can go up to there, look. Into there. And just blend that across. I can even do some blades of grass. Now, well, it just helps me blend in right up to these bits. Smaller detailing brush. Put some little blades of grass in look. There we are. That'll do for now. I'm gonna put some shadows over that. Right, uh, what have we got now? Let's get this spiky brush again. Get some more bright colours in here. Colours, take it a bit darker, a bit darker around the bottom of here. Bush. Now I want to keep them highlights, so I've got to work into there. Um, might be as well with my detailing brush for that. Let's try it. It's, it looks a bit like black. I need to go darker. It virtually is black now. Huh? So I'm just coming into here. Getting into this stuff, look, and it just gets me a bit of accuracy to get right in there. Yeah. Hopefully, make these highlights stand out against my low lights. Be a bit difficult to do that with that great big brush. So, I'll do it with that little one. There we are. That's it. And then. Uh, back to my big brush there. Now I ain't got to be accurate now, you see, because I'm further over uh, that. Uh, no, bit of this green in there. With a spiky brush. I think that's worked quite well. Hopefully, that looks like a realistic brush. I think it does, doesn't it? Right. Um, now then, got to get around this rock. I don't think this rock's as important. If I go over it a bit, I don't think it's really going to matter. So, there's what we've got here. It's a bit there, 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 there. So, I've done that without my detailing brush. So, I don't think it's as important if I go over it. And then I can blend that in like that and into there. Go fast. If you paint that slow, especially on this cheap paper, you'll end up with an odd line. Yeah. 
in there, look, which to be fair, sort of have ended up with a bit of an hard line in there, so to avoid that, paint faster, sort of blobbed it out a bit there. That'll do, that's it. Uh, <coughs> right, this is all pretty bright, so bright creams and greens. So, um, there's some darker green here, about there, just on that bit, it's not around there. Um, there's some creamy stuff. This creamy stuff back in. It's more creamy stuff. Sort of tree it looks like bits of grasses and stuff. Pop that in. And up there, it's pretty much sort of yellow. Yellow! Just a bright yellow up here. I'll pop a bit more in for a bit more. Just build it up a bit more. Uh, right, I'll build this up a bit more in here, I suppose. Oh, let's see in here, I think that's sort of grasses and stuff. See how this spiky brush does these grasses? Oh, no. I think that's a bush. Uh, some more. These are quite a creamy colour. Which grasses on this side a bit creamy about that. Some grasses there. Um, right. I think that will mix a purpley colour for some shadows. I'm not even gonna wash my brush, I'll just go in and start mixing a purpley cut. These purpley colours are better off all muddy anyway. Like a muddy purpley colour. See what I can get. Dee, dee, dee. I want it pretty transparent so I can see my other colours through it. So I've got quite a lot of water on there. Right, this bit here, look. That's sort of. supposed to represent that tree there. I'll stick some of that purple in there to get some of that colour. And I think what I'll do, my little detailing brush again, into that purple. Just do a couple, just where it's going up there a bit. The purpley grasses in there. That's it. Now I'll tell you what I'm going to do and all. These blobs here, I'm going to dab them because they'll only drip everywhere, take forever to dry, so I'll dab them. Dab them all. There. Eeny dee. That'll do. Alright, uh, uh, then. There's more shadows. There's a shadow coming off this one here. This one don't come that far. The shadows coming off this grass, looking at it, just where the grass gradually builds up, and that's creating a bit of shadows. So yeah, that one there, got this one up here looks got a bit of one off that one. This one here's got a little bit coming across. I think the sun must be quite low because these shadows are stretching across a lot. Mm. There's shadows under here, just from off these grasses, there's shadows. Uh, yeah, that's good. Looks nice. 
and I think what I'm going to do now, when I get that purple, I think I'll have a shadow here, what's coming across from some uh, off edge of paper there. Like that. And I think, I think I'm about done. I'm just sitting back and looking. I think I'm about done. Yeah, I'm about done. So, where's my little Peter and Paul brush? Where's that gone? Where's it gone? It's disappeared. Oh well, I use this one, it's slightly bigger. Poor little book job. Black mix in there. Let me go. Just get some black paint. They're a bit purple in it, aren't they? This is only mixing this for two little bods. Oh, I found my tiny little brush. That's my Peter and Paul brush. Tiny little one. Oh, call it my Peter and Paul brush because pop in. Peter. Paul, they're out looking for worms. Right. Uh, where's a dry bit? That's pretty dry. There. Let me stand back in here, look. Oh, dear. Just looking from standing back, that's always a good tip. Stand back and have a look. I think I need a bit more work in these greens here, so just a little bit more. I might even pop some of this purple in. It just looks like it's one solid block of colour, and it could do with breaking up a little bit. That's it, and I'll pop a bit. Up in there and all, not much. So that one is bright. Uh, Shut like that. Soften it a bit, maybe. As I'm trying to sit back now, that's a good tip. If you sit right back and hold your brush right at back there, then you can see what you're doing more. I think that looks better. And then probably a little dab in that one there. Stand back across the room again in a minute and have another look. Let's have another look and see if that looks better. Yeah, that's a lot better. But I'm still thinking a tiny bit more, just in a bit of grasses and stuff down here. Some bits. That's it. Let's stand back and have one more look. And if I'm happy, job's a good one. Yeah. Yeah, that'll do me. Brilliant. If you want, you can put a little man walking in. I'm not going to bother. Took up loads of time on 39 minutes. That's a, a long one. Right. Right, I'm going to go and take my dog to walk. Doofus is probably going to take his worm for a walk. So, the worms don't really walk, but according to Doofus the do, you know we ain't got no legs to me the wiggle. Never mind. I'll see the old beach. Yeah.